Hello and welcome back to our channel. So I wanted to show you guys this Dollar Tree haul that I got yesterday or last night um, because I found some cute things and I wanted to share. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I'm just gonna pull some stuff out. So first thing, um, I was seeing these little flip-flops a lot um, in our summer themed swaps in our Facebook group paper art swaps so I uh, was super excited to um, find them because I'm trying to fill up my uh, like summer theme stock so I have it for next year so I'm really happy I found these um, and I'd like to try to like replicate them so I'm super super excited about this um, really like them and um, if I do decide to try to make them myself, I will do a project share for that. And then I got some more oop, drop in stuff. Sorry, guys, that's my resin, my resin thing. So I got some more of these because I've been using them a lot and I'm running low on them. So I found some more, so I went ahead and grabbed some more. And I did get one in silver as well, you'll probably see it soon, but I got them um, in all the colors I could find. So that, that was nice. And then um, I found some really cute, like, popped up stickers that were for summer. So I got these. Um, so you have like the sunglasses that says summer. It's got a little ice cream that says, that says stay cool. So I thought those were neat, so I got those. <clears throat> And then I found a uh, different style of the rub-ons for the Independence Day stuff. So I went ahead and got this one too. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it or if I'm gonna send it um, to my swap partner for the mini book box. Um, we'll just see, uh, I'll just see what I wanna do. But this is pretty awesome, really excited about this. So um, definitely uh, uh, enjoyed finding that. And then, <clears throat> So I also found some of the, the beaded trims um, in red, white, and blue, or red, silver, and blue. So I was super excited about that because I want to use these to decorate um, not only the uh, mini book box, but the um, red, white, and blue uh, pennant that we're going to do in July. So um, we have two swaps that we're doing that are like... Um, not so much patriotic, but one is patriotic and the other one's just red, white, and blue themed. So um, this was a good find uh, for sure because I like using these on stuff. So I'm excited to have that. And then of course I picked up another one of these in case we're gonna do another embellishment box uh, swap because uh, I used the two that I had and I hadn't seen them for a while. So when I saw just this one, I went ahead and picked it up. Um, and then I picked up some pink beads because I have like all the other colors and I use these um, to put in my sequin mixes so because um, I do like the little lip gloss um, theme stuff so like for example this one right here is a little themed lip gloss I did for one of my uh, swaps so I like to put these beads in there and sometimes I put gems and different stuff. So I uh, go pick those up for that. And then I found these little fruit slices in that um, like enamel style um, with the silver. So I was really excited about these. I thought they were super cute. So I went ahead and grabbed uh, two of those. And then I also found uh, like the resin ones and trees and branches, which I thought would with the browns and stuff, this would be really cool for fall. And then, oh, this is a Father's Day card for my father-in-law. So it's a little toolbox. I that, thought that was really nice and really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed that for him. For a dollar, that's not a bad deal. And then <clears throat> this... Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, sorry guys. 
So this is for my daughter for her birthday because she likes dress up stuff. So I'm probably going to add something to this little ruffled piece. So some of this was birthday stuff. And then I found some little popcorn containers. So what I want to do with this, because we're doing a circus theme, is I want to like make a faux popcorn top like make some crochet um, popcorn and then like make like a little faux top and then put goodies in the bottom and put the faux top on top so it looks like a container of popcorn but we'll see if I can do that. If not, this will just be cute to send as like a little popcorn container. And then um, I found a bunch of these little bags which I hadn't seen before. And these are good for sticking like goodies in for swaps. So this was one design I found. And then uh, this is for my daughter's ephemera because I'm actually taking like her old, like anything that's like her Valentine's cards or um, like toys she gets that has like name brands on it. And I'm cutting, fussy cutting out the pieces and putting it in here. And then I'm going to give her construction paper and let her make uh, little paper art pieces so she can start learning how to do paper art crafts like I do. So I needed a container to put all her little stuff in and she picked this one. So that's what that's for. And then I found this tissue paper, which is like really pretty daisies. So I picked that up with some polka dots because I like these little themed uh, tissues and I have tons of the other ones. So uh, and then here's another set of those uh, bags and for a dollar you get 14 so it's like uh, to me that was a really good deal that will last me a long time so then here we see. I found some of these little arrow magnets and um, I think these are super cool um, just little extras I can toss in with swaps and then this is for my daughter's birthday we're doing a mermaid theme so I got her some mermaid themed napkins. And then I found this Hello Summer uh, gold uh, rub-ons. So of course I picked those up for my summer stuff to have something that, um, uh, to have just extra stuff for summer because we did a summer tag flip and I had it took me forever to find stuff to actually do it. So I've just been slowly collecting things for that. <laughs> And then um, there's another one of the, the fruit things. And then I got these. I'm going to use these to put in the containers as filler um, for our 4th of July swap. Should have grabbed two because I need one for the pennant as well, but that's okay. Uh, and then let's see what else. Mm. So I got this little uh, flamingo lip gloss because the theme I did for one of my summer stuff, well, it's summer themed, but it's got flamingos on it. So I thought it'd be cute to add that into the swap. And then I found this little summer um, sticker set. I don't really like the tie dye stuff, but I thought this one looked cute and it's, uh, it's still like interesting. So I grabbed that one. And then I found a set of long bags like really really long ones and I thought these would be cute to put their uh, paper straws in when I send paper straws and like some other extra goodies so I got those and then <clears throat> I'm gonna start doing little summer activities with my daughter so I grabbed these little um, tweezers for her so she can like uh, use these to pick things up and then I got these unicorn stickers i've not seen these before and i like the chalk designs i have the mermaid ones but i didn't have the unicorn ones so when i found those of course i scooped those up and then sorry guys i'm trying to go through it pretty fast and then of course i got more double-sided tape because i use that a lot like a lot a lot <laughs> so there we go i just pull it all out <laughs> So I got these sets of candles right here for my daughter for her birthday to put on her cake because I thought those were super cute and it's like little C characters and then uh, she also will have a cake topper and then uh, these little candles and like the little sparkly colors so I really like those and then I found these napkins that have like the holographic stars 
uh, like for unicorn style stuff. So I do collect napkins because um, I want to use them to make tags when I decide I want to do that. So this will be a really cool like thing to Mod Podge, Mod Podge onto tags or um, whatever onto whatever. So. And then, um, of course, another decoration for my daughter. It's a mermaid banner. It says, it's my day. I have one that already says happy birthday, but I figured we could um, decorate this one together. And then she could, like, because it's blank. And then we could hang this one up in her room. So, and then I got a birthday queen because my birthday is actually tomorrow, June 13th. So, I got a birthday queen sash for me because that, so I can wear it. <laughs> And then um, here's another set of bags that I found and some interesting colors. And then I found them in these colors as well. And then I found an inflatable decor for my daughter's birthday in a mermaid tail. So we grabbed that. And then um, here's some seashell plates. They had the other ones that were in purple, but I like these better. So I grabbed these because I think they're nice. They're like, they're like almost bowls. So I thought these were a lot cooler. And... Uh, so, and if we have any leftover, she could use these for our art project. So I thought that'd be really cool. So I got that. And then uh, this, is the, this is the last bag, y'all. This is the last bag. I'm trying to be quick about it. So let me pull out the rest of this. And see, I was wanting to use some of this yesterday and I decided not to so I could film my video. <laughs> so it's pretty funny. So, uh, of course, I got her a happy birthday with a six. So, if um, so, her cake will just be extra decorated. <laughs> and then these are the candles I picked out for my cake. Um, so that will be that'll be nice. It'll be fun. And then I found this really cute notepad that says "Hello, Sweet Summer" with watermelons, and um, it's just super cute and it's magnetic. So um, I'm gonna throw that into my summer swap because I have one more summer swap. And then I found these little plants with a little watering can. I've been collecting these. We haven't done a swap for any of this yet, but um, maybe eventually we will do like a plant themed one. So I've been collecting these. And then I found something that I was super duper duper excited about. I found circus themed stickers. <laughs> So uh, we are doing a swap in our group paper art swaps called uh, Circus Extravaganza. And um, it's not happening this month, but um, I've been like preparing for it because it's more of an advanced swap. We're going to do a mini album and uh, with embellishments. And I just thought if I could find circus stickers, it would be amazing. And then I found them. So I'm so excited. They do look a little kiddish, but I think they'll be cool mixed in with uh, different stuff. And I just, I love like the top hat and the balloons and you know, like the little circus ringleader and like just all the little pieces. It's just so cute. I love this. So then I also found some paper clips with tassels. Those are cute. Um, and I might actually try to do a recreation of some of this stuff. So that, that will be fun. Uh, to show and do videos on let, let me guys guys let me know if you think that would be fun to watch like doing recreations of some of the stuff I found and then I found fishes and seahorses like under the sea style stuff and they're like double layered so that's pretty cool and then I found this um, so I'm always like jotting down in different stuff and I lose it because it flies off my desk because I keep a fan on in here because it gets pretty warm in here because uh, the way that our house is facing the sun is always hitting this room. So um, it's like a sticker note book. So like I can write my swaps here and then write little notes about each swap in this little part. And then it all Velcros together. So all my stuff is in one spot. And my favorite color is green. So and I love like flowers and leaves and stuff. So this this was a no brainer. I did look for one that would match my swaps, but I didn't find any. And I'm not sure if the girls would like this. So I didn't pick any more up. But if you guys see these, like they're I think it's a good buy for a dollar. And then, of course, I picked up more happy birthday stickers because um, two of our ladies are going to have a birthday soon. And so I wanted to at least, like, make a card or make something for them. So I picked up another happy birthday. And then I found these really, really cool farmhouse stickers. They're like the big um, wall decor stuff. They're the same kind of texture, but they're tiny. So 
I thought it'd be cool to have some farmhouse themed stuff in case we do a swap that's like that. And some of these you could even use this for fall, like you could use the truck and, and put like something fall in it or whatever. So I thought these were really pretty and I found two. So I went ahead and got those. So I was kind of excited about that. And then there's the silver um, border stickers I was talking about. And then here's the red, the long red bags that I was saying we could put paper straws in. And then I got green chevron. And then I found some solid striped greens. And then I found, of course, I picked up two packs of those circus stickers because um, when you're doing a project, sometimes you wish you had like two. And when I find stuff that I don't normally find, I try to pick up at least two so I have them because sometimes I end up using them twice. And then I found these really cool like rainbow star napkins. So I thought that was really cool. Grab that. And then the last thing I grabbed was these little pom-pom paper clips. And I thought they were super cute too. So, uh, and they come in like dark pink, light pink, purple, and, and like a aqua blue, like a sea foam blue. So I thought these were really cool. And again, like I said, um, I might try to recreate these. So if I do, I'll make a, a video on it because that's pretty cool. And I want to see if how easy it would be to recreate these because it looks like they've actually got them inside the pom-poms. So that's everything I got for my haul. Um, I'm super excited about it. I'm happy I found some birthday stuff for my daughter um, because I've been looking online and whew, that stuff's expensive. So I'm happy I found some good stuff for for a good price and um i'm happy i found some stuff for upcoming swaps um if speaking of swaps uh if you guys are interested in paper art swaps paper art swaps on facebook um you guys go ahead and just uh look it up and um i'll put the name in my description so that you guys know um how to write it so um you can find the group and just go ahead and apply and, uh, I mean, we do swaps every month, um, and, uh, it's pretty fun, and we have a great group of ladies, so, um, if you're not already part of our group, I know a lot of you that follow me are, then, uh, if you're interested, I'd love to see you guys there, and I'd love to see what you guys create, but, uh, that's it, and, uh, if you're still here, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys soon.